Alexis McAllister was the first through the door, Ryan Grappenberg's the last. A 35 million pound signing from Brighton began a 150 million pound overhaul of the Liverpool midfield that was completed on deadline day with a similar fee for another gifted technician. The Argentinian has been a constant in the Premier League from the start, is beginning to live at Anfield interrupted by a red card that was opportune, yet his importance increased as he has taken on added duties. The Dutchman has featured more in the midweek side thus far. But his first two starts each yielded an assist. The third brought a first Liverpool goal, the best goal of his career, Graven Mertz said. Though it was a tap in, and this weekend may bring a different kinds of the first. The deadline day signings for a Premier League debut could come in McAllister's second reunion in a few days. One with his brother Kevin in Tuesday win over Union St. Giliose, and other with his old club Brighton. If it will provide a justification for Gravenberg's decision to trade Bayern Munich for Liverpool, he was only granted three Bundesliga starts in his year in Germany. Jurgen Klopp has seen enough to be excited. It includes his physicality. He may benefit too from McAllister's versatility which was acquired largely as a number 8, albeit with the idea they could also occupy as a number 6. Yet neither is a doppelganger for the departed Jordan Henderson and Fabinho. Neither, in short, is a conventional defensive midfielder, which is more constructive than destructive, but McAllister has shown that his passing can be an asset from the best of the midfield. Part of the key, Claude thinks, is ensuring he is not isolated or exposed. Problems occur in his aging midfield last season when the gaps become too big, when the different departments of his side become disjointed. Now, after a summer makeover, he has younger legs and a more attack-minded options. McAllister wearing 10 may have an extended run as a 6. McAllister had formed a fine trio with Dominic Soboslai and Curtis Jones, but with the Mercedes Siders suspended, it seems a question of whether Harvey Eden, Wataru Endo or Gravenberg will come in. So it could be just the second time when Klopp started with a midfielder comprised entirely of the summer signings. Endo had an awkward afternoon alongside McAllister and Soboslai in Newcastle, but the Japanese is 30. The long-term trio could be Gravenberg, still just 21, Alistair, already a World Cup winner at 24, and Sobosly, who has believed he's 22 years with an outstanding start.